I've learned doing videos. I've got iLife 11 now, and because of it, we went through this whole month-long adventure with it, where um, first we had to, we originally were going to do it on her card, but then we had to decided to change things around, and so it took like a um, way after Christmas to finally order it because she got me a she got an Amazon card and was going to give it to me, so I order it through them. Cool. <clears throat> and. Nowhere in any of Amazon's listings does it say that you need OS 10.63, which is Snow Leopard. Snow it just Leopard. says we'll work with an Intel Core Duo Mac, which I have. Mm -hmm. And so I order it, and it says disk unreadable. And I'm like, are you kidding me? And... <laughs> I do further research now, and I find out, especially from inside the manual in the quick start guide, it says must have Snow Leopard. I have Leopard. It comes with my Mac. So now I have to go out. I paid, like, almost 50 bucks with shipping for iLife. I go out there, and the entire upgrade that I need is only $23. So I end up paying 30 for that. Wait two more weeks. Is that a cop coming in? Oh, I don't think so. Cool. Wait two more weeks and get um, the iLife thing. Install iLife, no problem. We did that. I think we went out for the day while it was installing. Beautiful upgrade to the Mac. I love it. Cool. A little too fast. Requires a little too much speed for my Mac. It sometimes has to restart more often. That's a pain in the ass. Put in the disc for iLife disk unreadable. <laughs> so I called Mac back. I had called them about the original bullshit. Called Mac finally. And even though I'm past my warranties and I don't want to drop a hundred bucks on another year, they were still willing to send me another disk. Mm -hmm. Finally get that in the mail and it's not even like the iLife disk with the graphics on it. It's just iLife reboot disk or whatever. <clears throat> and that one is readable, but because um, of the amount of uh, RAM in my Mac, I had to leave off two of the five programs in order to keep it. And those were iWeb and, and iDVD, which I already have DVD software and I don't build web pages, so. Right, yeah, get rid of the things you don't need. So I can do, I've done, I'm gonna try and call it up on my phone. <clears throat> I did this music video. Tell her about the headphones. Oh, the headphones are even better. Okay. He, needs, well, he I got my iPhone because I got it for a penny and he had an upgrade. So it comes with the headphones with the shimmy ding, the microphone on it. And so he's like, I really want headphones with microphones. So I looked under Amazon, I found them for like four bucks. And so we ordered them. They don't work. And he's like, he brings it in to Dave. He's like, I can't figure out why they just work. Dave takes a paper clip or a pen pokes into his headphone jack, shakes the phone, a bunch of crap falls out. Any headphone he wants works. You didn't need to order. <laughs> That's good. It was it was really funny. He's like, you know, we probably didn't need to spend the money on that. I'm like, I'm aware of that. It was funny though. Oh. Huh. I'll text you the link in a minute, but... Yeah. If you ever... My battery's almost dead. Ah, crap! Okay, well, let's finish your... Yeah, let's do this whole thing. Um... No, the battery's got two-thirds. Yeah, I know. I was, um... Battery's fine. It's got at least another hour. I was pulling out the 